Hello everybody and welcome into this brief introduction to environmental science and technology. My name is Annie Babalari and I'm one of the four academic advisors in ENST. Not only is ENST a STEM major, it is also an interdisciplinary major which includes courses from many disciplines such as biology, chemistry, and physics. You can start your journey of becoming a scientific leader who address our most pressing environmental problems such as how do we feed the world without destroying the environment? Or how do we conserve and restore biodiversity? Let's see what environmental science and technology has to offer. Our one major has four different concentrations. Ecological technology and design, ecosystem health, soil and watershed sciences, and natural resources management. We also offer one minor, that of soil science. The Ecotech design concentration focuses on integrating the natural systems with the built environment in hopes to solve environmental problems. A few example classes in this major would be ecological design, ecosystem restoration, renewable energy, wetland creation and restoration, or green infrastructure. The ecosystem health concentration encompasses environmental factors and ecosystem functions that affect human health and the effects that human activities have on ecosystem products and services. A few classes that you'll encounter in this concentration are ecosystem health and protection, soil and water pollution, or emerging environmental threats. In the soil and watershed science concentration, you will learn how to understand the complex ways in which aquatic and terrestrial ecosystems are influenced by soil properties, processes, and land management decisions. Some example classes in this concentration are soil chemistry, wetland soils, soil microbial ecology, or watershed and wetland hydrology. In the natural resources management concentration, you will learn the environmentally sound use and management of natural resources. In this concentration, some example classes are remote sensing, introduction to fish and wildlife science, principles of wildlife management, or introduction to economics and the environment. All of our ENST students are required to take the following courses, Biology 1 and 2, Fundamentals of General Chemistry, Organic Chemistry 1, Calculus, Physics, and Statistics course. Also, uh, Soil Science, Introduction to Environmental Health, Ecosystem Ecology, the Senior Integrative Experience, and the Professional Internship. On top of these classes, each student will take concentration-specific courses. On that internship requirement, studies show that internships lead to better job opportunities. So our ENST students must complete an internship to receive the ENST 389 credit. And a lot of direction and guidance is provided in our undergraduate office and through the Career Center. Are you looking for opportunities to get involved? Well, ENSD is home to the student group RESTORE. RESTORE gives you opportunities to interact with students uh, within the ENSD major, to build leadership and organizational skills, and give back to the UMD community through service. ENSD is home to a great soil judging team as well. Soil judging is a fun way to spend time outside, challenge your brain, and get your hands dirty. It develops and tests your ability to apply knowledge and skills to real-world natural systems by learning how to describe and characterize soil and to make considerations for its use. Our soil judging team has won many national competitions and they had fun doing it. You might be asking, what can I do with a degree in ENST? In today's economy, there are many career options for graduates in environmental science and technology major, including careers in government agencies such as the EPA, USDA, or USGS, which are federal agencies, or the Department of Natural Resources or Maryland Department of the Environment as state agencies, and many others in local government. There are also many career opportunities in environmental consulting firms, in green industries, in non-governmental organizations. Furthermore, the ENST major includes a strong science and math foundation that prepares you for study in a wide range of graduate programs, including med school, vet school, or law school. These are the careers that previous ENST students have had. Many have worked in environmental firms, 
in the federal or state government, or in education. Many others have continued their education in medicine, academia, or have worked for NGOs. Where do you see yourself? Take a look at this list and see if any of these positions are of interest to you. Would you like to become an environmental scientist or educator, a conservation specialist, a wildlife biologist, or a waste to energy specialist? Whatever your interest in environmental science, we think that you will get a solid education in environmental science and tech, which will prepare you for the wonderful work that you will do during and after your academic career. If you would like to join in ENSD, go to ensd.umd.edu. Go into the Undergraduate tab, in the Frequently Asked Questions tab, and you'll find the information of what you should know about transferring to ENST. You can learn more about our program and our website, and also on our social media pages on Facebook and on Instagram. I thank you very much for watching, and if you have any questions, please contact me at my email down here.